How to fill a shape with an image in Photoshop, PC or Mac. Open an image and go to Select and Select All. Then go to Edit and Copy. That puts it into the pasteboard. Go to a completely fresh document and then go to the Custom Shape tool. Go up here to the Shape option. There's right at the top left, Shape. Go and select a shape. Just there, you can see a variety of different designs are available and simply drag and create. Go to the edit menu and paste. Then go to the layers panel and you can see now you've got your photo, image, etc. above your custom shape design. With that done, go over to layer and create clipping mask. And you can see straight away what happens. It just moves slightly, but you can see you've got your image now as part of that shape. Now select that layer, the image layer, and what you can do, just go over here to the move tool. There's the move tool and simply drag and move it around. So if you want your photo to be in a slightly different position, you can simply drag and move it around. You can also resize it, you can modify it. You can see you've got the bounds here so you can resize it like that. And press return. What you can also do, you can go to the custom shape itself and select that and you can resize that and you can see you can move it around. Now the image doesn't move beneath, however the shape does. So you can move it around and reposition it very quick and easy. You can also resize, move it around, rotate and much, much more. What you can also do, you can apply effects to it. So you can go to a layer and you can go down to a layer style, maybe bevel and emboss. And you can see you can get a nice beveled design there and maybe add a drop shadow as well. And again, you can still go back to the photo and you can move that photo, just move it around. So you decide, you know what, I want that to be the part of the image or that. What if you don't want a white background? Well, you can simply change that. Just go to layers panel and then go to the background, click that little padlock and now double click the layer. You can simply go to color overlay, click there and maybe go for a red or blue, etc. Click OK. Also, if you want, maybe go for a gradient overlay instead. So simply deselect that one and you've got yellow to green. Click OK. So you've got a nice background for your lovely shape design. Hope you found this video of interest. Always adding new tutorials all the time about Photoshop, Affinity, etc. A dislike or like, always appreciated. Also, any comments, please let me know below. If you've got any questions about any of the things done in this video, please let me know. Thank you much.